Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah Satuta if you're new here. I am at Disneyland um, if you haven't guessed yet and I decided to do a bell look because I've just been like on a princess kick and doing all the princesses and I have all the stonies for each of the princesses that they made so I figured might as well. So these are the bell ears that came out I want to say last year and I made this necklace myself. This set, I think it's from Revolve, but I got it from an influencer sale a couple years ago and she got it from Revolve, but I got it from her sale. <laughs> um, but anyways, I'm about to head inside and it's already super hot right now. So I don't know how I'm gonna survive that, but we, we will make it through. So like I always say, let's go to the happiest place on earth. <laughs> I just realized that Thursday, July 18th is um, National Dual Whip Day. So I think by the time I post this, it will be the next day. Um, so I'm here at the parks over the weekend. And I'm thinking I should probably get a Dole Whip so I can post something about National Dole Whip Day. And if I had to choose the Disneyland hotel one that um, Trader Sam's is the best, but I don't feel like sitting there. Um, it just, it takes a lot of time because it's obviously like a sit down, you sit at the bar, I mean, you can get a table, but there's also the Dole Whip, you can order um, via mobile. Forgot the name of the place, is it the Tiki, the Tiki one? But I don't really like plain pineapple. I mean, I like it, but it's okay compared to um, Tropical Hideaway, which you can't mobile order, but they have the best um, combos. I can c combine a couple flavors, I think two flavors. Trying to decide what I want to do, but I think I should get Dole Whip because it's going to be National Dole Whip Day on Thursday. Here's some new ears at the Fantasia store in Disneyland Hotel for DVC members. They have a full collection here too. They have some Dooney and Bork bags. There's the Dooney and Bork bags. There's a sweater, hat, water bottle, long t-shirt, spirit jersey. Let's see what's on the other side. Lounge fly. Polo and a tee. Since I came here a few days ago, now they don't have any more of the backpacks for the Disneyland Hotel collection or the ears, which I haven't seen yet. They just have a couple jackets and tops and this, this shirt right here. So looks like it was a hit. The suitcases are also gone. They were sitting right there. had to take a little detour and go to the front desk because I found someone's ticket on the women's bathroom floor. So I just wanted to give it to them in case they could find them or if they have to do something with them so no one else uses them except for the person who purchased them. But now we are off to downtown Disney. This is the new Haunted Mansion fanny that matches the backpack I showed the other day. It's pretty big and um, super cute. I like the design. These are the new Disney Eats ears with the spoon on top. Um, I'm not a fan of these ears. The neon green, um, the spoon, it's just not, not for me. This would have been cuter as a design on the front. I mean, the dripping is cool, but the green is insane. And it's not really designed that well because I saw this one and it's already loose. So you have a dangling spoon. <laughs> it literally is gonna fall off. So design-wise, this is not cute. If I had to choose any ears, I would pick those donut ones. They're so adorable, but uh, yeah, these aren't it. <laughs> Sorry. I saw this on Thursday, but I never got a chance to record it, but they have a bunch of areas blocked off. I think it's so they can do some updating for the turnstiles, but um, there's one there and there's one there. So obviously you have to go around it to get inside the parks.
toes till I get up Time is barely on our side I don't wanna waste what's left Stop This is part of the Haunted Mansion collection. It's magnets. This is the cutest kids backpack. I wish they made it in adult sizes. How adorable is this backpack? There's, is his name Giuseppe from Pistach Pistachio? Pinocchio. There he is. Oh. Let's go on the train. To those who have just come aboard, welcome. The next leg of our journey will take us from the fantastic world of the future to the breathtaking beauty of nature's own design. jersey for the shaved ice ears. I didn't realize they're, they're new until I just saw them again. I was like, wait, I haven't seen these before. This is actually a really nice looking spirit jersey and I like the, the colors. Looks so cute. It's perfect for summer. Decided to get some lunch. I got the vegan uh, wrap with the chips from Cafe Daisy. I wanted to get the burger, the vegan burger from Red Rose Tavern, but they don't have it anymore. So I guess it's, this is my plant-based item for the day. Here are the chips, which are vegan. And here's the wrap, which I've had before on the vlog. It's just a good go-to. I think that's kale, it has quinoa, and it has um, sunflower seeds and a, like a lemon dressing, I believe. I'm not sure if this is new, but this is really cool. It has an eye mask and it's a tech, what does it say? T travel tech accessory with eye mask. I'm not sure what that means, but it just kind of caught my eye because it's so cute. <laughs> so I'm gonna head to DCA. I just finished um, looking at all the stores. I picked up actually the Haunted Mansion Tumblr for a friend. Um, although I want one for myself, I'm not going to get it. Um, but yeah, it's a really hot day. I'm pretty tired. I couldn't get a toll whip from Tropical Hideaway because the line was insane. So it's okay. I'll just use some old footage for that. So if you see it on Instagram, I didn't really get it today, but it's okay. I can't wait till this is the Mickey Pumpkin in a couple weeks. I mean, obviously I love Pixar, but I'm excited for Halloween in the summertime. Look how beautiful these flowers are. I just noticed them right now. They are absolutely stunning. They look actually so re like so fake because they're so pretty. Look how beautiful these flowers are. I cannot get over this. Wow. They're right here by the Pixar sign. Here we are heading to DCA for a little quick view of anything new. Maybe I'll go on a ride. I haven't decided yet. This is the shaved ice backpack from Loungefly that goes with ears and the spirit jersey. I like the design of it. This is really pretty. If you're ever looking for the conductor hat, they have a million of them at the studio store in DCA in Hollywoodland. Um, people always want these and they're always sold out except for here. So make sure to check out the store. Black 
way home. These Baba Bar earrings are so cute for Mickey and Minnie. I think I have the Minnie ones, but these Mickey ones, I don't. I'm not gonna get them, but they're really cute. They are $40 and you can obviously use your discount on them, but I just wanted to point those out because they're adorable. I think, I think this is a new zip up and it's so freaking adorable. It's a hoodie and it has Avengers on the background. $64.99. Here's another hoodie that I haven't seen before. It's for Guardians of the Galaxy. It says Galaxy's Most Wanted, and it's a hoodie, which is great for the parks. It has all the characters from Guardians. And it's a zip up, most importantly, which is what I love. I don't really like hoodies that you pull over. $64.99. This is a cool necklace for Avengers. We got some nice earrings. I feel like I've shown this before, but just in case if I haven't, there is my girl, Scarlet Witch. I found this really cute hoodie in World of Disney for Star Wars. It's, I believe, $54.99. Okay. $59.99, my bad. And this is what it looks like. It's a nice blue color. Grogu. I love this bracelet right here with Mickey and it's gold. I love gold jewelry. I'm not sure how much it is, but it's adorable. Look at these fun socks for Mickey and Goofy. They look like they're playing football. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen these. On this fun tumbler. I used to love this movie as a kid, The Rescuers. So if you're a fan of The Rescuers, this tumbler is insanely cute. It is $22.99. It's plastic. It is just the cutest thing ever. I'm in love with this cup. It says Fantasia on it. it has Mickey. Look at this. Look at the nostalgia. This is Fantasia. But the best part, look, it has the little sorcerer hat that Mickey wears right there. And then look, it has glitter. Look at that. And they're little Mickeys. Oh my goodness. Wow. Do you see the Mickeys? For once, I'm not in Disneyland. I'm actually nowhere near Disneyland. I'm actually in Westwood, California, which is a neighborhood in LA. I am a huge fan of the takeout, eatery, restaurant, whatever you want to call it, um, Pratt. I have been since 2016 when I first visited one in London, England. And I was told yesterday by my coworker that there actually was one built in Westwood. And I didn't know. I think it just recently opened. I thought there was just the one in LAX International Terminal and one being built in the Century City Mall. So I said, you know what? I need to find this place. And I just parked. When I tell you how much I love Pret, like it's on another level. Um, I'm obsessed. It's my favorite place. I would go eat there every day. I was in London and every day I was in New York. So the last time I went was 2019. I actually got a gold coin from um, a manager in the New York location in 2018 because I literally was like I love Pratt I love the broccoli macaroni I love the sandwiches and he was like I think taken aback by me and my enthusiasm so anyways I'm gonna go try it and there it is just got back to the car I'm gonna be that girl who eats in her car because I need to drive to Universal after this but I got my favorite dish which is the mac and cheese I do like the one with the broccoli that they have in London but that's okay 
and I got that that's obviously vegetarian and then I got the vegan falafel and hummus wrap so this is obviously like way too much food but I just had to get these I'm obsessed literally been five years since I've had Pret my favorite place on earth I gotta find that coin because I've, I've wanted to use the coin when I was back in London but I'm like hmm maybe I should do it here so the first thing I got was the mac and cheese and it's crunchy on top, which I love. Mm. This is my favorite dish at Pret. Oh my God, divine. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is so good. I wish they had one in Orange County as well or more locations in LA. They only have it, she said, here and Studio City, which is kind of far for me, but I think I need to go there tomorrow. <laughs> um, but there's one being built in Century City Mall. It's not done yet. And then the one in LAX, which obviously I'm not going anywhere, but mm. oh my God, this is so good. The nostalgia, this brings like so many memories. I'm traveling by myself around the world to London and York, England and enjoying pet literally sitting there and eating my brunch <laughs> like so this is the vegan falafel hummus wrap mm -mm -mm. it has pickled veggies including pickle pickles it comes with a little pocket which i love it's like this reminds me of when i was enjoying it a couple years ago Mm, so good to find a vegan wrap with protein is like unheard of mm, so good literally so good <clears throat> I'm eating too fast I just parked at Universal oh my god it was so stressful to drive here I avoided the freeways because it's rush hour and I figured it's better to do the streetway. Oh my god, it was terrifying. It made me go on like Mulholland Drive and I was like, wow, I'm really high up. Um, so I'm kind of on edge right now. Um, it took me a good, I think, hour and 15 minutes to get here in one piece. Um, yeah, <laughs> I'm a little, I'm a little anxious right now. I guess uh, lesson learned to just use the freeway even if it's traffic. Um, yeah. I'm very um, uneasy about that drive. That was pretty scary. <laughs> I don't know if this is new, but they put the security over here, which is right by the entrance. I was like, where do I go through security? I don't know if it's because it's six o'clock at night, but they have it here near the door instead of way over there. So strange. Finally made it inside. Well, it was a trek to get in and I'm just gonna probably be here for about 45 minutes, but that's okay. I'm excited to finally be here. Wait, this is so cute. <laughs> Cowboy Hello Kitty. Um, how much? $35. The bucket hat is cute too. It's not reversible. Okay, the Hello Kitty merch is adorable. Oh, I love this cup. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm wearing the world's most simple outfit. This, I think this is from H&M, Amazon, and this is a vintage Tasmanian devil top. I mean, I honestly, I think Looney Tunes is universal. I don't know and my Viore bag, but I'm gonna try to show the back of my shirt without looking crazy. Let's see. Kind of see the back of my jacket. Nice. This is adorable. I mean, much cheaper than Disney, isn't it? I don't know what this is, but it's adorable. Sit all and I can't 
I love that they have posters because I'm a big vintage girly and I would totally get that Psycho one because I like that movie a lot. That's really cool that they have all these designs. This one's really cool. Wow, I love that. Looks like you can take pictures with certain things here. Here's E.T. There is the Back to the Future car. Wow. I'm gonna have to mute this because the music is really loud, but yeah, if you wanna see how cool this is, just keep watching. Till I get up Time is barely on our side I don't want to waste what's left The storms we chase are leading us And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah, No, I don't want to waste what's left And on and on we'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways Till my shadow Turns the sun rays and the That is so cool. I love Frankenstein. <laughs> We're gonna go to Harry Potter Land. Is that what it's called? We're going that direction. Oh, look. It says the roller coaster will be open in 2026. Wow, it's another year and a half. Kind of an ice cream. I think I'm gonna get ice cream. The ice cream is at Honeydukes here. Harry Potter land.
Here's my ice cream. It's currently melting. I got the pistachio flavor. I've tried toffee nut and butter beer, so let's see if I like it. I probably will just prefer the butter beer, but I thought maybe I should try something new. It's melting, so I'm gonna start eating it right now. <laughs> It's quite a view. Apparently, that's somebody famous, and I don't know who that is. Oh, he's a. Uh... That's somebody from a show called Young Sheldon. Some of the, the teenagers were going crazy, and I heard them saying it was young Sheldon. I don't know who. I'll have to look it up. 